friends welcome back to another video thank you so much for coming back for another one for clicking on this video for spending time with me spending your valuable time watching my videos it is greatly appreciated so thank you for coming back uh today's friday for me and it's been a very very busy week um i did a couple i had a couple days of um, decluttering every room in my house, getting ready for our big yard sale. I babysat my my granddaughter a few days. We had an awards banquet or an awards ceremony for Jackson at school. I we went wedding dress shopping yesterday. We found a dress. Madison said yes to the dress yesterday. So we did not expect, did not expect to find a dress. It was the first bridal shop that we, um, you know, had an appointment with. And we found one it, and it is so perfect. It is so perfect. And she has known since she was about, I would say for like over 10 years, she's known like a certain style, certain things that she wanted. And when we went in there, the lady was like nine out of 10 brides think that and they walk away with something completely different. But there's the one bride who gets exactly what she, she knew she wanted. So Madison was the one bride. She tried on very different style dresses. And then it was the one, it was the one that was so close to what she has always wanted. And she actually liked this a little bit better than what she's always. Been. So anyway, she said yes to the dress. We are one step closer. We are, like I said, full on wedding planning mode over here. Um, but this, this today I am going to be, Madison's going to come over in a little while and we're going to price everything because I would much rather have everything already priced out so people can know what they're going to pay before they come up and pay me. I don't like going to a yard sale when nothing has prices on it. It's just better that way. I prefer that. So we're going to spend probably a couple hours. I showed you all the stuff that I decluttered and then last night I picked up a bunch of stuff from Elena and then Madison's going to bring her stuff over today. Madison is going to be my helper tomorrow because I can't do it by myself. I'm also going to make a like chicken. I got my chicken thawing out like chicken rice, chicken broccoli rice bake. I, if I've ever made one, it's been, I don't even know. I don't even know if or when I've ever made one, but I love those. So I found a recipe on Pinterest. I'll link it down below if it's any good. And I do need to run to Walmart and get a few things. Um, Jackson has a lock-in tonight and I have to bring cookies, but I don't know if I'm going to make cookies. I might just buy cookies. I don't know. Um, I'm supposed to bring cookies for that. And also I need to get a few things, a few groceries just for the next week. Um, tomorrow I'm going to be too tired after my yard sale. So I'll go today. I'll seem to run by the bank because I need to have change for people. Um, I think that's all that I have to do. It is already one o'clock. I have not eaten anything. I'm probably going to run through a drive through and grab like a Wendy's crispy chicken sandwich. That's usually my go-to something. I don't know. Um, and get a few errands done because I got to pick him up in like two hours. I got my big old <laughs> wad of cash. I was gonna get 61s, and then I was thinking as I was standing there, I'm like, what if somebody gives me a five and they, you know, buy like one thing, or they give me a 10 and they buy one thing? I was like, those ones will go really fast. So I just probably went way overboard and got a hundred ones, and then I got 50 and fives, and then 80 and tens. Hopefully that's good. I, I think it'll be fine. I'm gonna have to bring all this cash back to put back in the bank, but. At least we'll be set. I, the last thing I want is to like have somebody want to buy something and I don't have change and then they just don't buy it or else I just have to give it to them, you know. Anyway, I'm going to go grab something small and quick for lunch and then I need to head to Walmart. I might go to Gabe's if I have time. Um, they, there's just a few things I wanted to look for there and they have really good... Oh, you know, I need to go to Ollie's. I think I'll go to Ollie's and look at their um, grocery section because... Alright, so I just need a crispy chicken sandwich. One crispy chicken. Would you like hamburgers and a drink with that? No, that's it. I need a drink, baby. Two eleven. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Got me a Wendy's crispy chicken with lettuce and mayonnaise. It's so tiny, but it's perfect because it's almost two o'clock, and I don't want to be. I want to be hungry for dinner.
Okay, I just got home from all the places. I'm gonna do a quick little shopping haul. Clyde, no, no, Clyde. No, no, we need to make, like put some wood on the door frame and like wrap rope around it so that, cause he scratches this one spot of my door frame. It drives me nuts. So I feel like we can put something over it. It'll keep him, he'll just scratch that. Anyway, I thought I'd do a quick little shopping haul. Got some milk, got some milk at Walmart. Um, I'd, I'm sure I'll end up going back to Walmart sometime during next week because I always need a few more things, but I got bananas. I didn't go to Aldi. I just didn't want to go to both. So I got also a cucumber. Also, if you notice this right here, probably wondering what it is. It looks like I got like marker on me or makeup, but I was in the basement decluttering the other day and I pulled some, or pushed something underneath the ladder and Marion had put wood on top of it and it fell and hit me so it's a bruise but it kind of looks like i have like a marker on me <laughs> um anyways i got i had seen several people talk about how good these were and i got them and i'm not really that much of a fan they were six dollars and 47 cents they're very soft if you like soft cookies even the chocolate it's all super soft but they were not worth the six 50 so Jackson needs cookies tonight and I just don't have time to make them and he had mentioned M&M cookies and they're already broken oh well I got a thing of m and I'll let him take some of those chocolate cookies too and then I got a snickerdoodle it's just a bunch of teenage boys they won't care they'll eat whatever and then I got some more of his drink mixes the crystal light I got some lunch meat and then I got some cream cheese. I need this for my dinner tonight. I got a big bag of my big, whoa, favorite dog treats. They, it's a better deal if you buy the big bag. Although this is $15 and it's crazy, but there's more there. It's a better deal. Um, then I bought this shirt. It's this Avia and it said it was $10, but I got it. It rang up six and it's got this like high low and it's got a slit on the side and I got a large a large because I wanted it to be a little oversized and fit with like leggings so it's super soft great for summer I got some of the buns Jackson loves and then I got this what is it apple turnover apple cinnamon danishes for Marion snacking and then I also got at Ollie's just got a couple of snacks I got these uh, dry roasted sweet and spicy peanuts He's, he loves to mix peanuts with raisins and he didn't have any more so I just grabbed some while I was there this is a raisin medley for $1.99 at Gabe's we stopped there on the way home Jackson and I and they have these which I stopped buying these I used to buy these all the time I stopped buying them because they're like $12 at Walmart but Gabe's had them has had them for $6.99 for $24 and they're the home style which are so good so we just put those in the snack box I need to go through Jackson's clothes because he just grew out of everything so we just ran and looked in the men's so we got him i got him he likes these like what are they called dry weave dry dry works this was 3.99 just a black real thin black t-shirt got him this nice polo it was 5.99 it's like navy blue dressy polo 5.99 and then i got this was 7.99 just a t-shirt with a flag on it. He liked that. So that is it. I'm going to put all this stuff away and I'm going to go ahead and start on dinner. It's only 4.15, but I need to start on it. And that way, because I have to leave in like before five to take, no, I have to leave in about an hour to take him to his game. And then I've got to start working on all the yard sale stuff.
Okay, so like I said, I'm going to link this recipe down below. I'm going to make changes. I always do. Um, it doesn't say to add chicken, but you can add a protein to anything like that. And I want to make it a meal, not just a side. So I'm just cooking up two chicken breasts with some garlic powder, salt and pepper, and oil. And then um, I ha it says dry mustard. I'm assuming it's the same as ground mustard. That's what I have. So um, also say six cups of broccoli. And I have no idea if this is six cups, but I'm going to chop them up pretty small. And then um, an onion, butter, cheese, some spices. Put some cream cheese. You don't use any cream of cream of soups so that's why I like this recipe also which I do like those and I use them but I thought I'll try it without it um, you cook the rice before you make it so it says two cups cooked I'm just gonna do two cups dry and it will make more than two cups so I'll just add in as much as I think I may add like more cream cheese or I'm not really sure it's kind of a lot of steps but we'll see if it's worth it it sounds delicious so um, I'm just going to make a few tweaks that I like, but obviously do it however you want, but I'll link it down below. Don't need someone to save me, no, and don't come running to blame me. Mm. From miles away, I can tell that something's off. Where you look and how you pause When you talk, I think you said enough You said you love for me something brand new You said this is something you would never do Here we are in your car Let me see who you are Who you really are, are yeah. Don't need you here to say you're sorry Cause if you're gonna leave me, then just do it Don't take it slow, don't be gentle No, I just gotta know If you're gonna leave me, then just do it Madison and Elena stuff up here. We're gonna go through this. We'll price it and keep it up here and then go downstairs for mine. But dinner's cooking. That was like a lot of steps on a night when I'm super busy. <laughs> Not the best night to make it, but it's gonna be good and it's gonna be worth it. So um, we're gonna go ahead and just like, I think we should probably just like lay it all out and then we're just gonna start pricing. You like that pillow? You wanna buy that pillow? Huh? Anything soft, he will find it and he will lay on it. Elena wants to sell her wedding bouquet. <laughs> I think that's so sad. I think she'll regret it. Maybe I'll hold on to it. I don't know. It's so pretty though. She loved all the, if you saw her wedding, she loved like all the bright, colorful flowers, obviously. And then the dresses were hunter green. So it was beautiful. We've got a big giant mess and the broccoli cheese casserole just came out. It looks delicious and smells so good. Thank you. 
Okay, one room down. Um, we've got two for a dollar. Then we priced all those individually. We put like the clothes outside in big bags. So we're gonna go downstairs. We've started pricing some of this already. All the clothes are gonna kind of be like one price. So but we've got a lot of stuff. So we didn't get through everything, we're just exhausted. So a lot of this is priced, a lot of it is gonna just be priced tomorrow. I'm gonna scrape the words off of this with my, this is just um, removable vinyl and that way people won't, you know, they'll say they can use it for other things. And then I need to make my big signs to put at the street and then that's gonna be it for tonight because it's going to be a very early morning. Madison doesn't feel good and she's gonna meet me over here. I'm looking pretty rough. Um, early in the morning I think we're gonna probably start putting stuff out about seven and then hopefully people won't come until eight we'll put eight on the signs reason my brand new big fat sharpie markers were going out but so we'll have one we have I know which signs I'm gonna put these on so the arrows are all different ways but I don't like to see a yard sale sign that has like tons of information because when you're going by you don't have time to read it it just needs to say yard sale this way <laughs> and then I put the date and the time hopefully these will work we'll get some traffic I also have another piece of this left over I'm gonna cut to put on some bigger pieces of furniture that we're gonna sell. But other than that, I'm gonna like let these markers recover a little while and then maybe they'll work better. So I'll cut this up and make some signs with that. But I'm gonna go ahead and be done. What time is it? 8.38. I definitely feel like there's a lot more we could do, but it's just, we're just tired. So, and I actually was supposed to edit tonight. I never did. My kitchen's a disaster. The whole house, the whole house is a disaster. I'm gonna need the whole weekend to recover, but that's okay. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. I appreciate your sport and all your views. I love you guys. I'm praying for you and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye. <music>